How do you add the Polygon Matic networks to your MetaMask account? Polygon has a bunch of different chains and you have to add them individually, as you can see here. Proof of Stake, ZK EVM, Maiden, which is coming soon, and Supernets, which will have their own details. Here's how to do that. Get your MetaMask open. I assume you have a MetaMask already. If you don't, link in description to a video that goes through that step by step. When you have a MetaMask set up though, it will default to the Ethereum mainnet right here. And we wanna switch it over to the Matic mainnet, either Proof of Stake, ZK EVM, or the other networks there. Here's the easy way to do that. Go to polygon.technology. I'll link it in the description. It's the Polygon Networks main page. From here, you can add networks very easily. Come to use Polygon right here and then go down to add proof of stake network to MetaMask, click that and it will add the network for you. I've got a bunch of different MetaMask accounts set up. You can just press next here and then add and that's it, it's automatic, and that can be a network that you can choose with all of your different wallets. Now, if you want to add a different type of network because that's the proof of stake chain, maybe you wanna add the ZK EVM chain or the other chains, uh, here's how to do that as well. On the polygon.technology main page, you can go to Polygon ZK EVM and then go over to the ZK EVM Explorer, click this and it's gonna take you through to Polygon Scan. Now from Polygon Scan, whether it's polygonscan.com or uh, zkevm.polygonscan.com, you can go down to the bottom of the page right here and as you can see, add ZK EVM network. So I'm gonna click this right here and it's gonna say, do you wanna add this network? Here are the details as you can see, Polygon ZK EVM, you have the RPC URL, chain ID, symbol is ETH and press approve like this. Uh, do you wanna switch the network? So right now I'm on the Ethereum mainnet, do I wanna switch over to the ZK EVM? Uh, I'll say yes, no problem, I can do that. Now if I look uh, on my MetaMask and I can get that up, what we can see is I'm actually on the Polygon ZK EVM network right here. So I don't have to do anything. I've got this wallet set up with the same wallet address on the Polygon uh, ZK EVM network. And then I can switch that over to the smart, uh, the Matic mainnet, which is the proof of stake mainnet if I want. And there you go. Here's the more detailed way to do that if you're having any issues. We can actually add networks manually into our MetaMask. What we have to do is get the correct information. I've got the info here for the proof of stake chain and the ZK EVM chain. I'll link these uh, articles in the description as well. But all you need to do is input the details of each network that you want to add. So we can do that right here. We're gonna add the Polygon proof of stake mainnet to our MetaMask. Go to MetaMask, top right hand corner, then click settings down at the bottom networks and then add a network. You can see all the networks I've added right here. Add a network, it may be here as one that you can add already. If it isn't, click add a network manually and then input the details. Network name, you can see it's Polygon Mainnet. You can choose anything you want here, Matic network or anything. So you can put Polygon proof of stake, something like that. Uh, and then you need the details here. So new RPC URL, this one, you have to copy paste and make sure it's in, because otherwise it won't work. You won't be able to communicate with the blockchain. Chain ID 137, like this. And then the currency symbol, as you can see, Matic right here. The currency symbol is for the coin that is used to pay for gas. And so on the proof of stake network on Polygon, you have to use Matic for gas. If you want to add a different Polygon network, for example, the ZK EVM or other networks, you just have to get the details for those as well. So again, I'll link the uh, ZK EVM details in the description to this article right here. You just need the RPC URL, which is this one. So copy this, go back to MetaMask, paste that in, call the network whatever you want. Uh, and then chain ID, you can see the details right here, 1101, so 1101. Currency symbol, make sure that's correct as well. Actually for the ZK EVM, the currency symbol is ETH, as you can see here, currency symbol Ethereum. So go back and put the currency symbol as ETH. The reason is on the ZK EVM, Ethereum is used for gas fees, and so you need the currency symbol to be ETH and nothing else, uh, otherwise it won't make sense. So just make sure that you're using the correct currency symbol as to which coin is used for gas on that specific Polygon network because they're all different and they may, may take different coins, either Matic or Ethereum. As each of the Polygon networks are different, they are not interoperable and so you have to treat them as completely separate chains. On the proof of stake network, you use Matic as the base layer gas coin and all of the assets on this network cannot be interchanged or sent from this one to another one of the Polygon Matic networks. So as you can see on the Polygon ZK EVM, if I switch to this, 
I have no assets in here, but I do have assets on the proof of stake chain. So if I wanna get assets into this chain, I have to copy this address and then go and send some ETH or Matic or any other of the supported currencies onto this chain specifically from my exchange. Many exchanges don't support this network, and so you have to check that with your exchange itself. The other thing you can do is bridge tokens from one Matic network to another using Ethereum as well. This isn't great, but it's the way it works at the moment. So come to the Polygon wallet, link in the description as well, I'll link it down there. And what you can do is go to the proof of stake chain or the ZK EVM chain right here, and you can bridge tokens back and forth through Ethereum mainnet. So as an example, we can connect a wallet right here, I'm gonna connect MetaMask, and it connects. So as long as you've got your MetaMask logged in uh, and on the correct uh, network, it should be able to see that uh, all of the assets in your MetaMask account are actually viewable in your Polygon wallet as well. Now what you can do is go ahead and bridge. So let's see the bridge right here. This is the proof of stake chain as you can see. So I can deposit and withdraw Matic uh, to and from the Ethereum mainnet and other tokens as well. So if I wanna put some ETH over from the Ethereum chain, I can do that click max right here and that will go to the polygon chain that is bridged over from ethereum mainnet over to the polygon proof of state chain i can do this also with the polygon zk evm as well so we can go here and you can see i've got no details in this account because uh you know i don't have anything in here i can go to bridge and as you can see, this is from the Ethereum mainnet as well. So the same MetaMask account with Ethereum mainnet and these two Polygon networks uh, added, I can uh, withdraw to and from Ethereum. So again, I can put the max in that I can send over from the Ethereum mainnet in my MetaMask uh, over to the ZK EVM. Just type I understand here and press bridge ETH to ZK EVM or you can choose these other assets as well. So if you have assets on Ethereum, you can bridge it over to proof of stake or ZK EVM as you want. You can't do the networks uh, with each other though. They have to go back to Ethereum first and then upwards. That's for the time being anyway. I'm James with MoneyZG. Cheers for watching and I'll see you in the next one.